A new unit of Hamas, trained and designed to harass Israel during the night, has now accelerated its efforts. They call themselves the Unit of the Night Confusion, and their purpose is to advance the march of return. Their strategy has turned from an open jihad with missiles, mines, and tunnels to popular activities aimed at gradually destroying Israel. Returning now to the studio to discuss this is Dr. Mordechai Kedav, expert on the Middle East from the Begin Sadat Center at bar -Lan University. Thanks so much for being with us. Pleasure, yeah. So can you discuss Hamas's new strategy and why this poses such a serious threat to Israel? Well, they found out that uh, missiles, tunnels, explosives look bad in the world media and actually justifies Israel retaliation. While kids who send kites or do, people at night who try to cut the, the, the fence are much more visible and people in the West uh, sympathize with this. And this is actually what they try to do, to bash Israel, to make Israel look bad by peaceful uh, activity like this, because this is the real arena which Israel will lose. The, the world media and the public opinion, or all these things, where they can actually defeat Israel, unlike uh, terrorism, as they prepare. Of course, they didn't give up on the terrorism, but to, for the time, since they cannot now fight against Israel because Israel can retaliate, they do these things. And this is a new strategy to defeat Israel in the public arena. How is that possible? Because bomb-filled kites are not innocuous. Well, it looks better because they call these balloons, kites, what do you want? So this is how they propose it in the Arab media, that Israel is, is afraid of balloons, you know, of kites. And this is the image which this activity makes, not like people are blown up in, in buses as they did before. So this is uh, what I mean by a new strategy to use the world media, the, was a public opinion as a weapon, and these kids are served as bullets in order to shoot Israel with his, with his people. So what is Israel's new strategy? Well, now I think that there is a, 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 new, a new approach. Uh, Israel, little by little, tries to isolate Gaza from the West Bank because part of these people's aggravation is against the PA, which blocks the money, blocks everything. And Abu Mazen actually wants Israel to do the dirty job for him. So now Israel, what Israel does is to allow oil to go to, to Gaza in order to have more electricity directly, not through the PA. Money comes to Israel from Qatar directly. And this also enables Qatar to spread its hegemony over Gaza, regardless of what happens in Ramallah. Actually, this is the new strategy to separate Gaza from the PA. Actually, this to fragment the PA because of the failure of the, both sides of the Palestinians, the so-called West Bank and or Ramallah and Gaza to work together since already for 11 years, they cannot cooperate on anything. Okay, this is the situation, let's go with it. And Israel actually goes with it by giving the oil uh, to Gaza directly, not through the money system of the PA. And this I think is a new strategy which Israel now starts to to operate uh, without talking about this, without announcement. And this, I think, can work. That's all the time we have today. Thank you for your analysis. Thank you so much, Ayel.